What's up guys, it's Master Saniel and welcome back to the channel. So in today's video, we are going to be talking about Town Hall 11. So it has actually been officially released as, and it's going to be in the new update, which is insane. We've been, we've been talking about Town Hall 11 for the past like two to three months. I've made tons of videos on that, ideas for Town Hall 11. And I can't believe that it's actually coming out. So if you're an active subscriber, an active fan, please consider leaving a like. Because this is amazing that it is actually coming out. And and every like does matter. And if we can reach 11 likes on this just for Town Hall 11, that would be insane. Every single like really helps. And you guys are the best. So as well as there being Town Hall 11, there is also going to be a brand new defense and hero coming along with this update. And this is being said that this is the small part of the update. This is just, the Town Hall 11 isn't even like a big part of the update. It's going to be extremely huge. And this is all that they've showed us in the latest Clash Con. So I've got you guys some gameplay of the Town Hall 11. It looks, uh, I, don't, I never really expected it to look like this. Comment down if you expected it to look like this because I, I have no idea. It does look pretty cool, to be honest, and nothing like I thought it would look like. But as well, the new defense, it looks insane, and it does an insane amount of damage by the looks of it. It looks like it is, like, more overpowered than the Inferno Tower. It is a super strong defense, and of course, to combat this, there is going to be a new hero. No one really knows what this new hero is yet, but all we know is just of the silhouette of the hero, and it does look super sick. And just looking at these new defense, how fast it can kill the Archer Queen is just outstanding. It's just so strong of a defense and and it does look really sick. And the Town Hall 11 look, I think it looks pretty cool. It's like a white look for the Town Hall. And I think it is a pretty good idea for Town Hall 11. It can hopefully bring more of the inactive Town Hall teams into the game to get to Town Hall 11 and hopefully... um bring some more Town Hall 9s that are inactive like myself into the game to hopefully like get to Town Hall 11. I'm probably going to be jamming to Town Hall 11 on one of my accounts if I can get a Town Hall 10 account or something and I think that would be really cool if we can do that. A huge jamming if you guys would like to see that. So give me any thoughts they have on the new hero as well as update thoughts in the comments. I'm pretty sure what else is going to be coming in the update will be the clan war tournaments so a clan war tournament is pretty much a whole huge tournament comprising of four to eight clans and the and the best clan does win so the winner of the clan would get tons more level up bonus to the clan as well as a lot more gold and elixir for the winning clan so i think that the clan war tournaments is a very good idea for the future and i'm pretty sure that they're going to implement it as well as well as they're going to be showing these sneak peeks throughout twitter uh, throughout the coming weeks in leading up to the update there's going to be so many sneak peeks and i'm gonna keep you guys updated with all of them so anyway that's pretty much it be sure to sub if you are new for more as well as leave a like and comment and that's pretty much it peace out guys